cars might be getting smarter, but the basic concept remains the same. Even when or even if they eventually manage to drive themselves, a car will still look fundamentally like a car. You can't say the same about an electric unicycle, a flying bike or a skateboard with square wheels though. Here are 10 inventions that will supercharge your trip from A to B and get you some odd stairs in the process. The Rhino is sleek and simple while evoking a deep-seated yearning for a more progressive future, the manufacturer says. It's half a motorbike, we say. This rather odd-looking Segway motorcycle mashup is yours for 5,295 American dollars, or roughly 3,200 pounds. It can whiz you around up to 10 miles an hour while carrying up to 260 pounds of cargo. The Flycly adds an ultra-thin electric motor and intelligent electronics to a normal bike wheel to give you that extra leg up when getting up hills. Best of all, it doubles as a security device for your wheels, letting you track and even remotely lock it if your bike gets nicked. Now, there's thinking outside the box, and then there's thinking so far outside the box that you can't remember where you left it or what the box looked like. We think Shark Wheels falls into the latter category, kicking back against the tyranny of circular wheels. It turns out these square looking, but not actually square wheels, grip better in wet conditions, handle soft surfaces with ease and slide more easily. Yes, this one looks a bit like someone's nailed a car tire to a girder, but at the moment at least, the one wheel is the closest thing we have to Back to the Future hoverboards, balancing and powering itself with a combination of direct drive hub motor, inertia sensors and some very clever software. We can see why the first bunch of Kickstarter orders have already sold out. It'll cost you just shy of $5,000 in the US, but this solar-powered tricycle is capable of 30 miles an hour and a range of just over 14 miles. That's in sunny California though. We reckon British weather and landscape would kill the battery much more quickly. Hovertrack's inventor Shane Chen has a track record when it comes to personal mobility. He's also got the solo wheel electric wheel and hydro glider electric surfboard under his belt. The Hovertrack is basically like a Segway boiled down to the bare essentials, namely two balancing wheels you control with your feet. Our choice of vehicle says a lot about us, and choosing an iGo says, look at me, I'm driving a chemical toilet. Yes, the thing looks terrible, which is a shame because it's actually rather clever. This self-balancing vehicle is good for 19 miles at 13 miles an hour with absolutely zero emissions. Honda isn't messing about here. The U3X Easy Rider comes from the same place as its robots, which the company hopes can address some of the issues facing a rapidly aging population. You won't see a shipping version anytime soon, but it's likely to influence future personal mobility transportation, for example, self-powered wheelchairs. We've been promised flying cars for decades, and B finally delivers on that promise. There's only one catch, it's too small for humans. And by too small, we mean it's a toy. This RC car copter has rotors in its wheels and is just as happy in the air as it is on the ground. For actual transportation though, it'll have to get a whole lot bigger, or we humans will just have to get a whole lot smaller. Ever wished your bike had six massive propellers on it? No, us neither. But Czech firms Durotech, Technodat and Evecta have teamed up to create just that. It's purely a prototype for now, which is reassuring, because it means nobody is likely to decapitate us during an afternoon bike ride anytime soon.